Hello everyone and welcome back to a new video. Abby's just gone for lunch, she's just one of those things. <laughs> <laughs> had a couple of weeks off because the history grind has been hard but we're back we've got oddie's house party tonight who is george Hello, Abby. You all right? we've got oddie's party tonight if you're a cabs crack og you know oddie um he oh, was yeah. my next door neighbor last year um massive happy birthday odds if you're watching yeah, happy birthday, Audi. Have a good one. See you in a bit. His knees? Knee, knee. <laughs> I love you, <laughs> We're getting ready to go now, guys. And it's very cold in Durham, and also the hat stops my hair from going frizzy. And, you know, it's super colour coordinated. Hey, guys. <laughs> This is the second week of second year and I'm just doing a vlog because this is what I do. Uh, recently I just hit 500 subscribers, so uh, yeah, that's brilliant. Um, so click the subscribe button, no, it's don't. like Inez here has never had a great snap so, mm -mm. so she's going to have her first ever sausage roll. I've never had a sausage roll, I've never had a Greg, so this is a big premiere. Right, okay. It's quite nice. <laughs> and it's nice and warm as well. Mm, no, it's quite lovely actually. <laughs> Thank you so much for your input. <laughs> I absolutely love a Greg sister drum. Mm. I've even got a coffee. <laughs> Queen. You'll be here every day now. <laughs> mm. Sausage drum. Hopefully not. I'm trying to watch my line. <laughs> That's just not going well because I drink like an absolute beast. So it's 3 a.m. and I have an essay due tomorrow. I did ages ago, but I need to go and hand it into the history department tomorrow. And for some reason, I have this thing. I have to print the essay off the night before. If I have to wake up and know that I need to print it, I just don't sleep well. We're back to the computer room. <laughs> if you used to watch my exam vlogs, this is, um, this is like a deja vu. <laughs> size 12 font as the history department request did it on a size 11 it brought my essay down from 16 to 13 pages so definitely saved a few trees today we're down at the dark guys smc dc we got any goals we won our darts game because the other team didn't show up we love darts we love darts. Sorry, you show at the wall. <laughs> no, no, no. It's um. <laughs> take if, your shoe if off. you no if you love darts, take your shoe off. If you love darts, take your shoe off. I thought it was. If we love darts, take your shoe off. Wait, what's the da what's the take your shoe off thing? If you off. Oh. If you love the darts, shoes off. If you love the darts, shoes off. Great chat. It's Monday night guys and I'm just in my room. I'm doing an essay. Really getting on my nerves though because I really wanted to have finished it today and I just have nothing to say. I'm on 900 words. It's a source commentary and it's only a formative and I'm doing the source that I've chosen to do is of Charles the First dining which I know sounds random. Wait I'll show you that I'll show you the image. So this is the image that I've chosen to do and essentially this is for my, if you're interested, 
I this is my art history module it's called the core art, art and power and basically the reason why this portrait is of significance is because so here is Charles um, the first Henrietta Maria his wife and Charles the second dining and then as you can see here's all his servants bringing him his food and then here's all of the like spectators and the wider public watching him eat if you are Mary's we've got some absolute insider goss here we've got the toasty bar king on his nightly tesco round <laughs> getting that halloumi wow an abundance of stock in that basket. Yeah, it would be getting mozzarella if any left, but there is no mozzarella. No mozzarella? Sadly not. It is Wednesday now, and I'm here with Emma, and we've just been for a flat white, yeah. which is like the statement Durham. It's typical Durham. Emma is head of duck, Mary's duck, with Charlotte, and I am the head of sponsorship. So we're going to Wittard. We've got quite a big budget for this one, haven't we? We have. I need to talk you through what we need. Yeah, you said that we need to get a hamper. Yeah. We need to order one. Also, I know this is random, but that, the Lumiere thing. So you know that's like an like a, a equestrian statue? Mm. Equestrian statues, fun historical fact guys, um, are yeah. a 17th century mark of status and it was when kings would build uh, like a ceremonial entry in a square right. they would put um, a statue of themselves riding a horse and Charles I put up his in Trafalgar Square and that is why that was the first one not this first one, but it was the one in England. It was early Stuart England, but that oh, is we've why... We've walked past Wittard. Oh, sorry, we've walked past Wittard. Right, you and your history. Okay. <laughs> that is why, if you this. go... No, this is fun fact. If you go to Trafalgar Square in London, a lot of the roads are called things like Henrietta Street or Henrietta hmm. Maria Street or Rupert Street because his wife was called Henrietta Maria. Really? You're into a bit of Charles I. Right, we're going to Wittard. Fun fact. But that, that statue over there just reminded me of that. Wittards feature a lot in our video. <laughs> They should stop sponsor us. You. Yeah, sponsor us. I think we'll get one of these. This, what so flavour is this? Pumpkin this spice? Pumpkin spice. Oh, no. Yeah. No, that wouldn't be mine. No. It's free. Come on then, yeah. <laughs> Silent night. I'll pour it in. Or green tea, that okay, counts. Let's go with that. I like green tea. I think that would be really nice. So we've just come out of Witter. Like 20 minutes later. And we ended up telling the manager that I'm a YouTuber and that I promote them <laughs> on my channel. She got it. I tried to drop the line of like, would you sponsor, give us any free things? And then they weren't like, having it. No, they were like, <laughs> maybe in a free item, which <laughs> costs like three pounds. Yeah, great, hun. Thanks. <laughs> we've come round to yeah, Olivia's. My old next door neighbour. Should we put a Christmas one on? No, it's way too early. Are you sad I'm not going? I thought you weren't going to be going and I was going to get your ticket. And Here she down. is. Hello. <laughs> She's made me a tea. We were also laughing earlier, guys, because the way Olivia speaks is just so, like, pleasurable to listen to. <laughs> pleasurable. Because when you ask Olivia a question, she never responds with yes or no. So if you say, oh, Olivia, could I have a tea? She'll go... Oh, yes, you... Oh, no, she'll go, she'll, she won't say yes. She'll just go, oh, you can. Olivia, have you got any milk? Oh, I do. <laughs> Something less Irish than that. <laughs> oh, oh, I do. do. <laughs> Hi. So it is Monday night now. We've done a full week of vlogging, um, so I'm going to end the vlog here. I really hope you enjoyed watching what I got up to this week. So as always, good luck if you're currently doing your university applications and getting in some of your offers. And I will see you next week. Bye.